Hi friends, welcome to Chase Glasses. Let's break down two important protein involved in iron metabolism, transferrin and ferritin. Different between transferrin and ferritin. Both play essential roles in managing iron in the body, but their functions and characteristics are quite different. Let's see feature by feature comparison. First up, type of protein. Transferrin is a glycoprotein while ferritin is a globular protein complex. Main function. Transferrin's job is to transport iron through bloodstream. Ferritin's role is to store iron safely inside cells. Location Transferrin is found mainly in blood plasma. Ferritin is located inside cells, especially in the liver, spleen, and bone marrow with small amounts in the blood. Iron state handled. Transferrin carries iron in the ferric state that's Fe3+. Ferritin can store both ferrous Fe2+, and ferric Fe3+, iron. Next, capacity. Each transferrin molecule can carry two iron ions. Ferritin, on the other hand, can store up to massive 4500 iron ions in its hollow shell. Next, iron availability. Transferrin delivers iron to cells by binding to transferrin receptors on the cell membranes. Ferritin releases iron intercellularly as needed no external receptors involved. Receptors involved in both protein functions. As mentioned, transferrin interacts with the transferrin receptors TFR. While ferritin doesn't use a receptor for iron release, it's regulated inside the cell. The final feature is role in health. Transferrin levels indicate iron transport status and can signal iron deficiency. Ferritin levels show how much iron is stored and are used to assess iron overload or deficiency. So to sum it up, transferrin is the iron transport in your blood. Ferritin is an iron storage protein inside your cells. If you find this helpful give it a like and share with others curious about how body handles iron thanks for watching i am jayashree and you have been learning with chase glasses for biology see you in the next video